Christmas, a time of joy and goodwill toward men. In the world in which we live today, things are not always as they should be. Got some good food in there. Oh, them people look like they're having a good time. Look at that, man. Looks like they got some mashed potatoes and gravy in there. Boy, I sure would like to have me some of that mashed potatoes and gravy. Hello, 
at Donaldson Cafe. David, hold on, please. David, get this guy out of here. Oh, give him some help. Look at it. Get, get the guy out of here. Come see me, can I bring me some food? Yeah. All right then. I'll be waiting for you. I got me a new chair. I'll let you sit in it. Okay, thank you. All right. All right, you're, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. Don't get in no trouble with that, that man in there. He, he seems like he might be a little bit mean. All right. All right. Well, I'm going to be waiting for you then. And uh, you come on by. Just just yell down in the box there. Just say Raymond, and uh, I'll let you in. All right. All right, thank you, son. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Friends, uh, I don't either. Nobody really likes me. Oh, I like you, David. 
I like you too, man. I like you a whole lot. You're, you're a fine young man. You, you give me that $2 a day and everything. Yeah, I really did appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah, I got this big Christmas box now. You know, last year I just had one little box I could lay down in and, and sleep in. That's about it. And the old boy down the, down the way here, he's down on his luck. He didn't have too big of a box either. But they hauled him off in England about three weeks ago. He, he's the only one to ever come up to see me. You, you're not glad you're coming up here to see me. Yeah, I don't really have a lot to do, and you know, I kind of want to help people out, so I just wanted to come over and give you some food. Well, I sure do appreciate it. You, you, you're a fine boy. You didn't get no trouble, uh, that, 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 that man there now on the phone, did you? No. Oh, well, that's good, because I, I don't want to get no trouble bringing that stuff, but I sure do appreciate it, though. You going to come back tomorrow and bring me some more? Yeah, I think I got to go now. You think you gotta go? Well, you be careful, because there's, there's a couple mean boys live down here, and uh, you stay away from them, all right? All right. All right, David, I'll see you tomorrow then. See ya. All right, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. I, I'm so sure glad that boy came. I'm going to sit down here and, and check out this mashed potatoes and gravy. Mm, they're still hot, too. Oh, yeah. That's, uh, that, that's going to be good, man. some money so you can feed yourself. Either do some cooking or go buy some food, okay? Actually, this isn't for me. Who's it for? Raymond. Who's Raymond? That guy that walks down the street. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Give me that. No, we're not feeding homeless people. Forget it. Go ahead. Oh, by the way, make sure you wear a uniform instead of wearing those same old clothes all the time. And also, never again. No free food, no nothing. Okay? Go ahead. Well, kind of lonesome here. I'm kind of all by myself. I, I wish I had a little company. That, that boy's going to come back again, I think. Raymond? Yeah, David, is that you again? Yeah. Come on in, David. All right. Come on in here. You, you give me some more food tonight? No. Talk to my boss, and I told him I was getting food for you, and he doesn't like me feeding the homeless, so he took the food away from me. Oh, uh, yeah, come come right over here. They don't feel bad about that. What? That's all right. I, I, just, I didn't want you to get no trouble or nothing. Well, I'm gonna give you my radio. I don't really use it anymore. You gonna give me a radio? Mm -hmm. It's got batteries and everything. It works fine. Yeah, uh, I ain't had no radio in a long time. This this really gonna be nice, Dave. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. I sit this down here and I can listen to Christmas music and stuff. I got me these candles here with a little bit of light and it helps out some, keeps me warm in here some. Yeah. Oh, I, I'm sorry you, you couldn't get no food, but I, I do, man. And, uh, I hope I hope you didn't get you no trouble or nothing. No, I'll be okay. Oh, well, I tell you, uh, that, that old man in there seemed a little bit mean anyway, and but uh, you know, anytime you. Can't get no food. That's all right. Just long as you come and see me, cause I, I really do enjoy your company. Yeah, I enjoy being here. Well, I, I'm glad you came. And uh, the, the old mean boys didn't give you no trouble. You left there last night, did they? No. Oh, that's good. Cause sometimes they pick on me. They they think uh, they think I'm stupid or something. But I'm not really stupid. I just you know, you know I ain't the brightest thing around, but I ain't stupid. So just, just stay away from the mean boys and everything. Well, I tell you. You gotta go again. Yeah, I need to get home. Go to bed, cause it's been a rough day today. Yeah, I know you, you work hard. I, I know that. Now, I, cause I seen you out there working. 
Well, David, I, I, I appreciate it, and I really do appreciate this radio, too. Yeah. You're going you gonna to come back and see me tomorrow night. You ain't bringing nothing. Just, just you come back and see me. Just say hi. I, I appreciate it. All right. You're going to do that? Mm-hmm. All righty. Oh, you, be, you, you be careful then going home. I, I'm just going to sit right here in my chair then. And, all right. And, I, and I'll, I'll wait around for you for tomorrow. All right. I hope you enjoy the radio. Oh, I'm going to enjoy I'm going to turn it on here and listen to Lula's Christmas music. All right. Thank you, David. See ya. Bye. Bye. That's a nice radio right there. I'm uh, waiting for that young boy to come on out. He's going to bring me some more food tonight. I think my mom's going to come see me too this year. I really think she is. I, I got to, wrote this letter here. I'm going to mail it. And that boy gave me that $2. I got me a stamp. And I'm going to mail it to her. And I really think she's going to come see me this time. Uh, I know she ain't real proud of me the way I turned out. But but uh, I'm really going to miss her. I got this new chair. And uh, I'm going to let her sit in it. If I can find me a cushion down there at that, uh, down there at that uh, throwaway place. Uh, it make it real comfortable. Lord, I, I, I'd I appreciate if you'd uh, let her come on see me this time because uh, I really miss my mama. And, uh, it's getting cold out here. I got a little pain right here. I, I think maybe I ate too much of mashed potatoes and gravy, but I, I think I won't go on in and sit down in my box now. Lord, I appreciate it. You got me my new friend and you let my mama come see me. It's going to be the best Christmas I ever had. I think I'm going to go in and sit down now. It's getting a little bit cold. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. cans in the kitchen with the bags in them? Not yet. Get your garbage cans, put the bags in like I actually do every night. on the end of the counter over there. Okay. But can I have some severance pay before I leave? Severance pay. You can go ahead and get that slop I was going to feed to my dog. How about that? Is that good severance pay for you? That's fine. All right, go ahead. Can you believe this? Man, I can't believe we're trying to do that again. Go on, get out of here. Good luck, man. 
Merry Christmas. Yeah. First, I get fired. Now, they cut off my electricity in my house. All I have now is this food to give to Raymond. If I give this to him, at least it'll make me happy this Christmas. I wonder what's in here anyway. Oh my. I could do a lot of things with this. Rami will be very happy. Hey, Raymond. Hey, Raymond. Hey, I mean, I bought you food, man, and you never guess what was in here. It was money. Raymond. Hey, Raymond. Raymond! Oh no. No. Raymond! Wake up! No. No, you can't be dead. You're my only friend. You can't die. Well, with this money that I have, you didn't have much in life, but I can make you a really nice funeral with this money get you the best that I can get. camp near the airport. A homeless man was found dead in the box behind me. Another tragedy on Christmas Eve. We should all appreciate what we have. This is April O'Reilly, KBOX TV. Christmas. A time of joy and goodwill toward men. In the world in which we live today, things are not always as they should be.